have cramps, you want to pinch your biceps to instantly reduce some of that pain. So I just played tennis yesterday and my calves, and I haven't played in over a year, and so my calves, man, just even walking, my calves are like super tight. So what I've been doing for myself, and something you can do if you haven't exercised in a while, is you want to pinch your biceps, right? Pinch your biceps, because this muscle, your biceps right here, correspond basically to your calves, right? So your calves, these are just muscles. So by pinching your biceps, and you pinch it like this, right? That will increase the blood circulation to your calves, which will help decrease some of that lactic acid buildup. That's why you're feeling the cramps. That's why you're feeling the stiffness and tightness. So pinch both biceps, pinch both biceps, and that will help both of your calves. Make sure you comment below and make on how this works. Follow this post. Follow me on TikTok. And I came to acupuncture for a severe neck and hip and back pain. Um, the treatments have been um, outstanding. I've actually um, have no more neck or hip or back pain. Um, you know, I, I started out, um, you know, very skeptical and now I'm just convinced that acupuncture is the way to go. It just helped me completely. And um, I recommend Yen Acupuncture to anyone who, who feels um, pain or any sort of discomfort. Um, this, is, this is the way to go. <laughs> So the question today is, you know, what does Confucius say about eating rice? Well, it's a little different topic, and he doesn't really say about, you know, whether it's healthy or not to eat rice. What he does say about eating rice is this. He says, give a bowl of rice to a man, and you will feed him for one day. But if you teach him how to grow his own rice, then you will save his life. So this is from Confucius. So I love Confucius, thousands of years of wisdom that we can learn from people in the, in, in the past. And so if you give a bowl of man rice, this is almost similar to like when you, if you feed, if you give a man a fish, you feed him for one day. If you teach him how to fish, you feed him for a life. No, this is similar, right? But similar, but yeah, a little different. And this is what we do actually at Achieve and Integrative Health. We basically, instead of just giving a bowl uh, of rice to, a, uh, to our patients, you know, we teach them how to grow their own rice. So we teach them their body on how we, we help them retrain their body so that their body can actually self-heal again. Because all of our bodies were born to self-heal, right? It's just something happened between when we were self-healing to now we messed it up. So something happened in between. So what we do at Achieve Integrative Health using acupuncture and Chinese medicine and nutrition is to get them back to where they were before, where their body was actually self-healing, right? But at the same time, we also teach them the tools. Because not everybody has the tools, the right tools on what to do with dietary, nutrition, and lifestyle, um, and, and, and all these, you know, how to live a healthy lifestyle. And so, you know, nobody has all the answers. So we are constantly also learning, because we're also learning because we want to be able to teach people how to grow their own rice, right? Um, whether you want to eat rice or not, that's, that's not the point of today's post, right? The point of today is we want to basically, whenever you do something, in anything that you do, don't you want to be able to do it, to learn it, and be able to replicate it and duplicate it yourself instead of actually having someone have to, to, to basically hand feed you every single time, right? Or maybe some of us, we like to be hand fed, right? Uh, but majority of us, we like to be independent, right? Here in the US, we like to be independent. And so in order to be independent, you gotta learn how to grow your own rice, right? This also applies to, because uh, I coach a lot of acupuncturists all around the world and helping them become a better acupuncturist, produce better skills, and also growing their practice, growing their business. And it's the same concept. When I teach them, you know, I do give, I mean, we do give people their bowl, their bowl of rice here in the clinic because that solves the temporary, the, the short-term solution, short-term problem, right? But we wanna provide a long-term solution. We have to teach them how to grow their own rice. We gotta make their own bodies regain that ability to heal itself. Because if you don't do that, then you're gonna be dependent upon it for the rest. Of, they're gonna be dependent upon acupuncture for the rest of their life. They're gonna be dependent upon something for the rest of their life, right? Which some people like and some people don't. Most people don't like, but some people you know, prefer that. But it's the same, whether it's in health, whether it's building a business, whether it's improving your acupuncture skills, um, that's what we do, that's what I do at Achieve Integrative Health and also in my coaching business. Uh, so, you know, the, the key is we wanna focus on restoring function, getting the body to heal itself. 
Because the body, BJ Palmer said this, which was really good. He's a chiropractor, kind of the founder, the godfather of, chi of chiropractic. And he said, you know, um, what, what do you think exactly? He said, you know, the body that made, the, the, the power that made the body heals the body. So repeat that. The power that made the body heals the body, right? So your body was built with the ability to heal itself. We just need to regain, help you regain that ability. And for some people, it is highly possible. For others, it's not. For some people, we've damaged our body so much, we can't regain that, that overall healing ability, right? You're gonna be dependent upon something else. Um, but for the majority of us, the power that made the body heals the body. Um, so we can actually get you back to, to that power state and uh, so that your body's healing itself again, right? Hopefully that makes sense. Um, and if it doesn't, comment below, ask your questions, uh, let me know. Let me know if this was beneficial. If you know that someone needs this right now, this powerful message, give them, share this post, tag this post, uh, let them know about this, right? Um, anybody, any teachers out there, right? Any coaches out there, this is a great analogy. This is a great quote by Confucius we should all learn from. And uh, that way we can build our next generation. All right, guys? And as always, I want you to remember, everything in life is achievable. So it's up to you to make it happen.